Today we are checking out a brand new game called South of the Circle. A compelling narrative experience fueled by a desire to keep our promises. I feel like I've seen this game maybe in one of those like showcases. Like, okay, that looks pretty cool. That looks interesting. And it popped up, it's released today. And I thought, why not? So doing a part one, if you guys want to do a part two, you guys know what to do. Leave your likes and comments below and let's jump in. Apparently it might get a little bit emotional. I'm just saying. Can't park there. <laughs> uh, sorry, completely ruined the mood. Okay, we actually. Oh, ah, confusion, concern. What do I do? Hey, what happened? What's that little beeping red light over there? Hey, hey, come on, wake up, wake up. Come on. You alive? You're right. Ah! Oh. I, God, my leg, it's jammed. It's jammed in here. Here, here let me help. Am I able to select an option now? I'm just like holding triangle, uh, hoping for the best. Uh, it's broken. Oh That's no. Broken. I'm stuck on a bloody rudder pedal. Are you sure? Ah, uh, see if there's a first aid kit around, would you? Should be behind There's got to be something. Yeah, I can see one right there, look. That works. Is that gonna fix a broken leg? Okay, so my... Ah, that's better. What's the... I don't understand what the, those are doing. Where are we? Hopefully not out of range of the radio mast. Is that what that flashing light is? Is that, is that the radio Mayday, tower? This is Alpha Romeo Lima. Crashed south of Deception. Coordinates roughly 82 south, 19 west. Come on. It's going to be absolutely freezing Hello, outside. Hello Faraday, do you read? So what do we do? Do you think you can move? Uh, uh, well, that's your lot. Uh, puts pay to flying out of here. I'm good for nothing like this. Um, what's this? Not in this weather either. Mm, weather too. is a big concern. At least I saved the plane. Did you? Hey, 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 see that up there? We were about to fly over one of the British outposts. Deception point, that should be it there. Maybe they've got a doctor. Yeah, I think I can see it. So can you make it? I mean, I can try. Make it? It's, it's freezing out there. Would you rather stay in this tin can and we both freeze to death? I... Uh, we, we, we could wait. Oh, come on, mate. Your fairy godmother's not going to magically appear. Nobody knows we're here. Oh, come on, mate. I've done my best to get us down in one piece. <laughs> they found me to be a man, eh? Time to be a man. All right, sure. How far right. away do you think it is? Let's Could do it. Five, ten miles. Uh, can you make it? We don't really have a choice, do we? Yeah. Good man. How will I find my way back? Uh, uh, there might be something here. I, uh, can Maybe a box flare or... I Is there a light qualified. on the flame? Yeah. Flares. See? I'm on it. You keep an eye out. I'll open this window and send one up on the hour to help you get your bearings. Hey! Hey, you here? Who's there? What's, that? What's he doing? 
I'm here. I'm here. Just don't lose yourself out there, okay? Just keep straight. Just follow that big fat light. I'll be back as soon as I can. You just mind that leg. Yeah, thanks. Hey, you watch out, okay? It's ten below zero. Oh, that is cold. Uh, wish me luck. Ooh. That is very, very cold. Okay, we're going. Yeah. Best of British luck. Hip hip. I'll be back in home. I'll be back home for Christmas and some tea and biscuits. The dialogue is really good, actually. It's really, really well done. Right, where are we going? Am I controlling the guy? I think so. Uh, yeah. I've got a silver trophy already. I right, should just follow that line and don't get lost. I smell a transition. I don't know why. Is that it? That's too bad. That was lucky. We're actually quite close. Minus 10. Can you imagine that on your face? Oh. I said, didn't I? I said it. Well, this is more comfortable. I knew it. I knew it. I called it. Do I run for the train? No, you gotta hurry up. You gotta sprint. Man, this guy is chilled. I'll be sprinting for my life. Oh, here, let me help. Oh, I think I can manage. No, honestly, it's fine. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Not as easy as it looks. Oh, dear. Let me give you a hand. Oh, no, no, no. I, I can do it. Um, Go on, then. It's easier with both of us, don't you think? All right, um, on three. One, two, three. <laughs> That's my fault. There's too many books. Isn't it bricks? <laughs> That's what's in here. Oh. Well, uh, there you go. Teamwork. <laughs> Not a problem at all. Thank you. Right, um, I'll, I'll leave you to it. Oh, do you join me? Oh. Well, I don't think you'd have much luck finding another free carriage. Sure. Uh, all right, thank you. Wow. Must be a looker. What's this one? Let's go for a circle response. Your work? My students. They haven't learned the art of editing just yet. Still, someone's got to mark it. You're, you're marking all of that. I'm not trying to. I can't complain. When I was a student, my professor said to me, you don't expect me to mark all that, do you? So I won't complain now they're handing me all this. Well, um, feel free to complain to me if it helps. <laughs> it might. Thank you. You got, you got any better lines than that? <laughs> Long journey? Yes, all the way from Edinburgh. Oh. Where are you headed? Cambridge. And you are too, I can see that. Um, you jacket? can see? How? Is it my suit? Well, I prefer Priestley's ideas about weather patterns personally. I beg your pardon? Your book fell out onto the seat. Oh, ah. <laughs> Would you mind if I take a look? Oh, yes. I missed are really getting on very quickly. There is some chemistry here. <coughs> Formulation of complex cloud patterns. GB McCall. I found it rather heavy going myself. You've you've read it? <laughs> I had to set this one for my undergraduates. Not that any of them probably read the bloody thing. The fact that you've got it on you makes me think you're not a student. You're lecturing too, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Likewise. Uh, how long have you been here? It'll be my second year. Dr. Hamilton. Clara McCarrick. 
How'd you do? Doctor? Oh, you're a uh, bookmark. Oh, oh, oh uh, don't worry, it's just a, just a telegram. Oh, you're a, uh, your telegram, it's sorry. Nothing. It's nothing, just something from my professor. Sorry, I wasn't supposed to see that, was I? It's completely fine, really. I got awkward very quickly. Professors do love a telegram, don't they? Your sounds just like my old one. My office, we need to talk about your work. <laughs> like we're still at school. <laughs> I'm sure you're not really in trouble. It's mad, isn't it? All these old men having a final say over our future. Deciding whether our work's good enough. How it all rests on that one final paper we need just to get anywhere. I know. I, I, I know. I wish they'd actually come and see me teaching. I, I don't know why they don't. I'd love to go and see other lecturers if I were them. I should do it more often. Uh, you'd be welcome to come to mine. Oh, thank you. Uh, if there's space, perhaps. How many students make it to them? Um, a fair amount. Oh, uh, hundreds. Hundreds? <laughs> That's a lot of undergraduates. Maybe you'll see for yourself. Maybe I will. Oh. oh, there's a red light up ahead. I suppose I can get a little more work done. Well, yeah, there's a red light. Let me know when we're Similar coming up to the, to the... of Cambridge, won't you? Oh, and we're back. Damn. I was enjoying that. <laughs> Very cool transition, though. I, I see what you did there. Very clever. Uh, so this game, I bought it for, I think, about eight ninety nine UK pounds on PlayStation. I think it's releasing on Switch, Xbox as well. Um, yeah. So obviously it's not a full price game. I think there's a slight, I had a slight PSN Plus discount as well. No barrels. I don't know random fuel barrel was just lying around. This guy is absolutely freezing. He is desperate to get on that train and <laughs> be back in that situation all over again. Chance to that young lady. Yeah, I could feel the chemistry instantly. <gasps> the British flag. Roar, Britannia. Sorry. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, carried away. Hello, is anyone here? That mini. Anyone here? Some slight weird visual glitches there. It's definitely more of a, a sort of story. There's not much gameplay there. Some people don't mind that. Some people don't. just want a good story, which I completely get. Which is Hello? What I like, a good story. Is anybody I'm here? Light switch there. There's no one here. How are we going to get help if no one's here? Oh. So, do come and see me if you have any questions on many, the lecture. One or two would be nice. And they're gone. Three people turned up to that lecture. What? You can leave if you like. It's over. Or do you have a question? I do, in fact. Oh, she's here. No. Yes. Are we allowed to visit other people's lectures? Oh. Oh, it's you. Um, I, I didn't see you up there. Where is she? You decided to come. I did. Uh, liked it? I didn't think you were too bad. Huh. Well, um, I'm glad you thought so. The others don't seem to care so much. Make a run for it as soon as they can. Well, they're a loss. I wouldn't worry. People all seem a bit jumpy at the moment. I found it fascinating. Finding a way to trace the paths of all the world's clouds across the sky. It, it is fascinating, you're right. It's quite poetic, I thought. I can get a bit carried away sometimes. But in, in theory, it, it's great. It's, um, just need to prove it's possible. It's, uh, taking a while. I'm sure a you wonderful will. subject for your paper, I would have thought. 
<clears throat> yes, you would have thought. Well, I've had no luck with mine, if it's any consolation. Just getting anything approved is a nightmare. Still, they can't say no once they've found my beautiful subject, like you. It's true, I am a, an excellent subject. <laughs> Hang on, Dr. Hamilton hasn't finished in here yet. Sorry about that, a bit too keen sometimes. Are they all here for your lecture? Wow. Yes. Damn. You'd be welcome to stay if you like. I would love to. Oh, I'll be honoured. Uh, well, why, why not? Thank you. Wonderful. I'll just go see to this mob and give you time to gather your papers. Is there different outcomes? I guess, I guess there might be a little bit. Is there different endings? Hmm. Okay. Oh. I like how this game works, though. I know some people are going, eh, it's boring. <laughs> Where's the gameplay? But I am intrigued. Very intrigued. I say that a lot, but I am. I mean it. Is that a picture of the Queen? Anyone back here? I mean, I am moving the guy around right now. That is that is gameplay. <laughs> so someone's been here recently. That cigarette is still smoking. Oh, got some posters of some ladies. Okay. Someone writing something? It's like someone left in a hurry. Maybe they went to the plane, potentially. Dear Annie, it's hard... Oh, can, can I keep reading? Yeah, I can. It's hard getting words out. Locked down by the Raph Jones condition has taken its turn. Last supply shop didn't bring enough. He's upstairs in the lab now. Uh, poor chap, still doing his observation work. Muttering. They're getting closer. Over. Oh my god, what the hell is this about? It's unsettling, the other men. We're trapped here. N nobody knows what to do. This just got scary all of a sudden. Who's coming? That's okay. Please don't tell me this is a horror game. I will freak out. I did not know this was going to be like a horror game. So someone's upstairs in a lab. They didn't get enough supplies. And he's muttering. They're getting closer. They're getting closer. Okay, got some drugs here. What does this do? Migraines, epilepsy, bipolar. Okay. There's another door here. Let's have a look. I don't actually have a chance to go upstairs, did I? I should probably check that. I can see footprints, and there was a cigarette that was still smoking. So people have left here in a hurry. They might have gone to visit the crash. So I imagine they've probably heard that or saw something. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Damn the transitions. Oh. Okay, that's a very quick transition. What? This looks like maybe the generator? Potentially? Seems to be still working. Uh, imagine he just fell and died. You screwed up. You're an idiot. <laughs> Run. I don't think I can. No. I seem to have power still. There seems to be some form of communication. There's just no one here. Is that a mini on tracks? Maybe we could try and drive it. It's locked because we need a key. Okay. So look out for a key.
Maybe this is where we can ask for help. Mayday, Mayday, we have closed in Antarctica. Antarctica. <laughs> why does that so weird? I don't know why, why did I just say it so weird? Uh, Antarctica. Is it still working? Please be working. Does anyone know? So, let's turn it on. Let's try and get a signal. Boy. You won't believe this, kids. I used to do this if I wanted to try and listen to a radio station. I know, I'm mad. Tune it in. Before digital radios. Made in England. They're very patriotic. Hello. Oh. Hello, can anyone hear me? Come in. Hello? Oh, damn, the transitions. I said you can come in. Doors open. Idiot. Idiot. Oh. Oh, oh, uh, oh sorry. Sorry. Ah. Good to see some work being done. Good show. My goodness, it's gloomy in here. No, do sit down. You got my note, I presume? Um, note? yeah, sure. The Telegraph. Well, I'm sure you've been very busy, which explains why I haven't heard from you. So, seems I have to come and pay you a visit instead. Still plugging away, I see. Mind if I take a look? Um, yeah, sure. It's still very much work in progress. <clears throat> and most of them are, are just uh, weather readings from my contact in South America. Not much to read yet. You will tell me when you've got something, won't you? As your professor, I do need to be kept abreast of things. Sure. Definitely. Of course. I'm sorry. I, I, I just need to collate all these readings, and then I'll be on the home straight. I do hope so. Good grief! I'm not surprised you're getting nothing done with all this racket. What is it this time? Oh, more of them today, I see, getting ready for another march, I suppose. And I can't quite believe how many women are out there. The more they let in, the less serious studying seems to get done in this place. Not built for academic work, I fear. Well, I really don't see why they want to join this band of Soviet sympathizers. Okay. Soviet sympathizers? Well, you know what I mean. Anyone who's for nuclear disarmament is anti-British, as far as I can see. I can't stand all this politics in my college. I wanted to talk to you about that, in fact. Okay, about go politics. on. politics? That's right. Sit down. What worries me is that all that is distracting people from the very good academic work we do here. This is where I really do need your help, Peter. Sure, go on in. What can I do about it? As you know, I have some friends in high places. I need to persuade these people that this college deserves to survive, deserves the reputation we've built over the years. Now, there's a lot of talk suggesting we're a soft touch breeding ground for communists. I need to show we're serious about what we do and what I need from you is something publishable. Okay. You think I'm not working hard enough? It might look slow, but I I'm working as fast as I can, I assure you. I don't doubt it. Make sure it is good, something first rate. This is a great institution, Peter. I need to prove its worth, and I need you to prove yours too. Prove yeah. my work? It's been three years now. Three years? Sure you understand what I'm saying? Sure. Not quite. <laughs> or not. <laughs> Is this paper really taking up so much of your ample brain power? I mean, your oh, position boy. isn't necessarily permanent. I'm sure you're 
hoping you don't have to stay in this dark little room forever. And I'm sure you'll rather leave it after a well-deserved promotion. That's all. Oh, uh, one more thing. The atmosphere here, things have been a little fraught. You must have noticed it's not just those protests that I'm concerned about. You know all about the business with the Cambridge Four, I presume? Uh, no. I, I don't, actually. You don't? A Soviet spyry. Recruited right here in Cambridge. Passing secrets to the Russians uh. for years, and we knew nothing about it. The papers are having a field day with it. They used to hang for things like this. You think something's going on? They think the Cambridge Four might now be the Cambridge Five. They still don't know who the fifth member is yet. Oh, no. I see where this is going. I need to be absolutely sure we are on our guard. Is it the female we met so I'd like on you the to train? Keep an eye out. You would tell me if you saw anything oh. suspicious, wouldn't you? Oh, I, can I see where this is going. Sure, yep, definitely. I, I'm, I'm not sure I'll be much use holed up in here, but I'll certainly keep an eye out. Glad to hear it. I'll see myself out. You carry on. A little bit of a poke there. Um, I don't know if we're going to get a promotion or get sacked, honestly. I honestly have no idea. Um, so, we'll see. So we don't seem to have a signal yet. Oh. Oh. That was something. I don't know what it was. That's something. I don't know what it is, though. Oh. Oh. Is that the plane? Peter here. Peter. Thank God you made it. Are you there? Is there a doctor? Can someone come and pick me up? There's no one Ford. here right now. Something's not right. I, I think. I think something's happened here. Something's happened. What, what do you mean? I don't know. Uh, well, there's. There's nobody here. The place is abandoned. What do, what do we do? Hello? Uh, that's impossible. They have, to, they have to have someone stationed here all year round. Floyd, it's not just the place is empty. Ev everyone's things are here. There are just no people. It's like, they, it's like they've all vanished. Well, they might be out on some kind of exercise, a research trip, something like that. Take them a vehicle and head it out. But there's a vehicle no, here. they didn't take the vehicle that's here. That doesn't sound right. And wherever they went, they, they went in a hurry. Uh, there's... Footprints everywhere, and they left a mess in their living quarters. What kind of mess? Broken glass, uh, an overturned chair, that sort of thing. Like, like they've been a fight? No, no, why would anyone need to fight out here? Oh, listen to me. I don't like the sound of this. I want you to get out of there as quick as you can, you hear me? Okay. Out, in, out into that again? No. Where would I go? Back to you? No, no, don't come back, Peter. Two hours to get there, and you come back here, and then where are we? Back to square one. So what do we do? Listen carefully. I don't know for sure, but it's possible that the base you're in might have been attacked. What? Attacked? This is a research station. Who would attack this place? Soviets. Oh. Um. Soviets? Here. And the Cold War hasn't been so cold around here recently. People are ticky. I've heard stories of shots being fired. And you could kill a dozen men down here and no one would know about it. What the hell? Oh, you're making me nervous. I've met the guys who work at Deception Point, mate. They run a tight ship. It's not like them to leave it completely deserted without telling anyone. And now you're telling me there are signs of a struggle? You can't rule it out. 
I don't like this. I, I think I should come back. No. No, there's a chance I can raise someone from here, but if you come back and I can't, then we're back at square one. They'd have to have us both on their case. Look, I'll keep trying on the radio. You've got to move on. Get out of there quickly. What do I do? All right, I, I, I can do it, but where the hell would I go? Uh, let's have a look. A map. Ah, okay. There's Cathedral a map. Rock. A map. Right. Oh, what's on it? I, I can see where I am. The base at Deception Point. Okay, okay, great. Anything north from there? Cathedral Rock? What's that? There are more buildings to the north. Do you know what they are? So maybe we can get there are you sure the in the car. Don't worry, Norwegians are allies. They okay. help us. Just pray there'll be someone there when you arrive. You mentioned there was a vehicle. Have you got keys? I do now. Uh, got them. I've got them. Bless something. Let's hope they fill the tank up. Can you see a route on the map? Any landmarks to follow? Cathedral Rock. Up ahead, there's, there's some kind of huge rock marked on here. Uh, C Cathedral Rock. Looks like the highest point around. Maybe I'll be able to see the Norwegian base from there. Sounds like that's your first destination. Peter, can you see anything you can use as a weapon? I don't think I've got so. My hands. That's all. Well, don't go searching for one if there's nothing else in there. You don't know when they might come back. I wonder if there was a weapon upstairs. Floyd, are you still there? I will, and, and remember those flares. Yeah, I heard you. Hey, look, I've got to go. You just get to that cathedral rock. Over and out. So we don't have a weapon. We have a vehicle. We have a destination, but it's not looking great. The Soviets might be involved here. We're in the middle of the Cold War, and boy, is it cold. It is very, very, very cold. Should we do a part two? Bit of a tease there. We're going to stop. Oof, better than I thought, actually. I am hooked on the story. The voice acting in this is incredible. Uh, I'm not quite sure about... That, that style is quite cool. It feels like a sort of old-fashioned sort of retro painting or something. But, yeah, the um, the voice acting, the story, I'm hooked to this. I want to see what happens. Let me know if you guys want me to do more. Leave a like, leave a comment below, subscribe. And, uh, yeah, see you guys soon. Bye-bye.